flying high, flashing wings across the sky. Jordy Racer, Jordy Racer, on the road, in the street, hear the sound of pounding feet. Jordy Racer, Jordy Racer, fly! The story so far. Spuggy had had a sleepless night. Was his dad mixed up in crime? What should he do? Spuggy tried to talk to Mickey Stone. Hi, Spuggy. Did you win? Nah. Blue Flash never came back. He's lost. Is there anything else on your mind? Well, I'm always ready to listen. Anytime you like. Meanwhile, Blue Flash had been found. But Victor took him to Baz. Victor told Baz the bird had been... smashed in a storm. Baz was going to keep Blue Flash for himself. What happened next? Baz tricked Dad into drawing... a plan. A plan of the recreation centre. What is Baz up to? Spuggy and Janie already have their suspicions, but have they guessed right about that second message? Seaton Delaville Hall? What? What about the cells at Seaton Delaville Hall? We saw that man there, didn't we? Maybe he was picking stuff up. In the cellars? Cellar man? It's plain enough to me. So, he could be there again on Monday. So, on Monday, Spuggy and Janie went to Seton Delaval Hall again. They slipped into the cellars. Spuggy went outside and waited. What's the time? Just gone 12 o'clock. Somebody must come, so long as it's not my dad. Spuggy! <laughs> Oh, word watchers, it certainly looks as if Victor's on his way to the cellars. He must be cellar man. Spuggy and Janie guessed right about that second message. Oh, clues followed up and another mystery solved. Oh, just like Dog Detective. What a word, but don't take fright. Have a go, you might be right. Look ahead. Look behind, see what clues you can find. Use your head, think it out. What's the sentence all about? Janie took a photograph of the stolen something. What did they find in the cellars? 
Have a guess. Pictures? Janie took a photograph of the stolen pictures. Still in doubt. Look at the letters and check it out. Paintings. Janie took a photograph of the stolen paintings. With a word you don't know, the main thing is to have a go. So Janie took a photograph of the stolen paintings. Photographs are real evidence. In the dark, you need... Yes, Janie took a flash photograph of the stolen paintings. Why? But they hadn't been able to take a photograph of this. The Gosforth Pendant. They had found it at St Mary's. But Spuggy's dad had picked it up for Baz. End a word with N and T. What do you get with N and T? You get what you want. You want to be rich? N and T make you a pendant. You want to be safe? N and T bring you an attendant. Dig your allotment. You want a good time? N and T give you excitement. Got the point beam where we went. Got the messages we sent. End a word with N and T. What do you get with N and T? You get what you want. Well, word watchers, oh, what I want is Mickey. <laughs> Where's he got to? He must still be busy in the office. Hello, Mickey Stone. Hello, Station Officer Taylor. Thanks for calling. Uh, it's about the letter you sent uh, regarding the, the cycle ride from Land's End to John O'Groats. You and the fellas are cycling for charity. I thought it'd be a nice idea if we could come out and have a chat to you this morning. About half eleven? Great. I mean, if you've got the bikes there... Then... Aha! A message from Mickey! I am no the telly... <laughs> that doesn't make sense. I've made a mistake. <laughs> Just like that other high-powered DJ I know. Way Glad you're tuning in today. What's this next disc I'm going to play? A great new album, Dick Dark, No Drums? Ay, 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 that's kinda odd. Start again, you silly bob. What's the first letter of that word? Dick Dark, on drums. Yeah, greatest title you ever heard. It's Funky Man. Well, the DJ got it right in the end. Oh, but don't forget, it always pays to check that first letter. Still no sign of Mickey. And just when I've got something really special, I want to show him. Look. Oh, this is going to be fun. Oh, hang on. Another message. Whoa. Off to ride a bike. Hmm. How long is that going to take? But look, Mickey seems to have got the message too. He's got magic he really sorted out at last. It's all thanks to our kite and the magic E wizard. And away. I'm the wizard magic E. I'm the wizard magic E. I'll make sure you recognize Magic E with ears and eyes. Use your ears, use your eyes. Wee Magic E! 
If you slid, you had a slide with magic E. Hit your shin, let's make it shine with magic E. You want your strip, you have a stripe with magic E. And if you win, you'll get some wine with magic E. Wee! Magic E. Slid. Shin. Strip. Win. With me, magic E. Wee! Magic E. This is Mickey Stone, BBC Radio Newcastle, and I'm at the city centre fire station. Bob, you're raising money for a, a local children's hospital for the Burns Unit. Are, are you doing it all via sponsorship? Uh, yeah, that's right. Uh, we're selling tickets at ten pence each to the public. We're asking them to guess how long it's going to take us to ride the event. And uh, we've got several good prizes if they guess right. What sort of figure are you trying to raise at the end of it all? Uh, we're trying to get about £7,500. Uh, it's for a specialist bed for the Burns Unit at the Fleming Hospital. Another easy bikes to, to handle and to get used to? Feel free to have a go if you'd like. <laughs> all right, go on, you talked me into it. Got a high saddle though, this I must... Oh, this is not, not easy, it takes a fair bit of getting used to. Um, I think rather you than me doing Land's End to Jonah Gross. Best of luck to you. OK, thanks very much. Thanks a lot. Hi, Woody. Hello, you're back at last. I got the story I wanted. I think I'll run it in tomorrow's show. Oh, did you get my messages okay? Yes, thanks. Magic E and all. Oh, good. But now you're here, I want to show you this. The new Geordie Racer computer game. And I'm in it. Oh. Look, I've got to a bit that's all about carrier pigeons. They've got messages for us. Um, can I play? Yes. Sit down and have a go. And the word watchers can help you. It's much better fun if we all play it together. Now, press that. What? This? Yes. Ha-ha! <laughs> There's me! <laughs> oh, look, there's Blink. A flap. Flip. And flop. They're carrier pigeons. They carry the messages. And they've got a message for us. But what's that for, Wordy? It means press the space bar, Mickey. Oh. Which is that? Oh, look, there's Blink. Here is my message. The artist something or other up the steep mountain. The rain has washed a word off. The missing word is one of these. Oh, I see, Wordy. I've actually got to fill in the missing word. That's right. Right. Well, the artist walked up the steep mountain. Good try. But there is a better word. <laughs> try again. If it's not walked... The artist clinging up the steep mountain? No, that doesn't make sense. So it must be the artist climbed up a steep mountain. That's it! Ha <laughs> ha! Now your turn, Flap. He's something a river far below. He swam a river far below? Not quite right. But where do you do swim a river? Yes, but if he's at the top of a mountain, he won't be swimming a river down below, silly. Oh. Try again. Well, it must be he saw a river far below. That's it. Hey, hey, word watchers. The pigeon messages in the Geordie Racer computer game are going to keep Mickey busy for quite a while. And there's lots of different things for him to do after that. So why don't we catch up with the story? Spuggy and Janie have worked out the cellar man message, but they want to get some proper evidence. What happened next? Oh, let's read about it.
Well, this shows we were right about the messages. You must speak to your dad now, Spuggy. <laughs> Buggy found his dad on the allotment. He seemed very happy. Now then, son. In back to fattle the day, are we? I saw you at the lighthouse the other day, Dad. I didn't know what you were doing there. Oh, what do you mean, man? I was picking up some junk for Buzz. It wasn't junk. You know it wasn't. Eh? It was the stuff stolen in Gosforth, the gold pendant. The undaft man or what? You're working for crooks, Dad. Look. Burglars, they steal the stuff, then they hide it. Then they send a message by pigeon telling Baz where it is. This painting was hidden at Seaton Delaval Hall. That pendant was hid at St. Mary's. And ye picked it up for Baz. And you thought I knew? I needed a job, man. I wanted to work. I, I drove Baz's truck. But I need crook, man. Hey, we've got to trust each other, right? What's the matter? Seems I'm mixed up with a lot of crooks. That's what's the matter. <laughs> We're mixed up straight, man. You're giving us a nice bit of cash for me holiday. We're going to help ourselves to the takings at the recreation centre. Thanks to this bonny little map, you drew for us. Well, I never knew that's what you wanted it for. Nobody's going to understand that, no other way. Best thing you can do is say no. Just keep your mouth shut and you'll be all right. <laughs> I'll keep these. Dog. Dad didn't know what to do. But by the time he'd got home, he had made up his mind. He must go to the police. Dad! Dad! Mum's had a fall. She's tripped over a plod, and I think she's broken her leg. 